Because most of us, including our students, work on a combination of devices like a laptop, a home desktop, and an iPad, it's a great idea to use cloud-based applications for file creation and storage. All students and staff in Jeffco have a Google Apps account, and using this account to create and store content from your iPad is ideal. There are two free Google Apps you will probably want to download to your iPad from the App Store, Google Chrome and Google Drive. Google Chrome is another internet browser, like Safari, and will look and operate very similarly to the Chrome you have on your school computer. Drive is an app designed by Google to give you a mobile-friendly view of your documents and Google Apps tools. The first time I open Google Chrome, I must accept Terms of Use. It's not necessary to sign into the browser itself, so you may skip Sign In here. I can use Chrome to search and browse anywhere on the internet, but to access my Drive or Docs files, I need to go to drive.google.com. Here, I need to log in with my Jeffco Google credentials. Then I am prompted to download the app, which I have already done, so I will just close this window. I see a list of some of my files, and I can search for additional ones. Currently, I can edit documents and spreadsheets on the iPad, but my Google presentations are view only. This view is different from the one that I'm used to with Google. When using the Google Chrome browser, many iPad users prefer to use the option at the bottom of the screen to view Google Docs in the desktop version. The desktop version is more familiar and features the full editing toolbar when working with documents and spreadsheets. When you open a document, it will often default back to the mobile view, which requires me to press edit, and then gives me some very basic text entry. However, if you tap the double arrows or scroll down to the bottom and choose desktop, you will have your full featured editing toolbar and can edit your document just like you do on your computer. The first time you click the Upload button in the Chrome app, you'll be prompted to allow Chrome to access your camera roll. Make sure you click OK, or Allow Access. After you do so, you'll be able to upload any videos or pictures that you've taken with your iPad, or that have been stored on your camera roll. This is an ideal way to transfer content off the iPad to the cloud. Remember that many apps, like iMovie and Explain Everything, will export projects to the camera roll. If you can get an app's finished product to your camera roll, you can easily upload it to Google Drive, where you will be able to access it from any computer. I'm going to upload an image from my camera roll. Once uploaded, items can be shared with others just like any other Google Doc. Let's peek at the Drive app now. The Drive app is a mobile designed view of the same content we just looked at. While many users prefer to use the desktop view of their Google Drive docs instead of this Drive app, you may wish to have both on your iPad to see which you like best. Remember, the content you are accessing is the same. The Drive app is just a different view that is supposed to be more mobile friendly. When I open Drive, I need to enter my Jeffco Google credentials again. I can see all of my documents in list view, and just like in Chrome, I can search for additional documents here. I can open a document to edit it, but my editing toolbar does have fewer options than in the desktop view of the Chrome app, but it does feature the most commonly used tools. I can create a new document or spreadsheet by tapping on the plus icon and can also upload from my camera roll here too. This time I will upload a video, which can take a longer time. You can tap uploads to watch its progress. Once uploaded, I can share my video with others or view it from my iPad. Google offers document creation and file storage in the cloud, which is ideal for workflow on multiple devices, so documents can be started on an iPad and edited later on a laptop or vice versa. Google Drive is also an ideal way for users to move video, 
pictures, and app products that export to the camera roll off the iPad and share them easily with others. Download both and see which you prefer for accessing your Google Docs and Drive content.